this 1932 Alfa Romeo 8C 2300 Monza is just a remarkable machine. It's supercharged. It's a straight eight. Amazing technology for the day. These cars were just fabulous with the amount of innovation and technology. This one was having some issues with the electronic ignition and timing. We um, discovered that at some point someone had put a Petronix ignition system in it, and we had to reverse engineer it and move it back to points. And by doing so, we were able to improve on the drivability of the vehicle. The Petronix was having issues where it was going out of phase. There's a lot of movement in the mechanical advance on this vehicle. So you're going to see a test drive here and you're going to see the improvements. Awesome. The thing I'm just still a little concerned on is that it seems like the timing's too, too high though. But it cleans up that high. Yeah. So we tried it, you know, there it doesn't happen. He wasn't happy till 
It got to it got 40 to degrees. 40 degrees advance. And the, then it's like you saw it, it just changed it, off. Oh, know? yeah, it took, yeah. It's got a little flutter spot, it might be jetting in the middle. It seems like it flutters a little. Well, I don't think it's that. I, I think it's that advance because on a regular distributor, you've got your centrifugal advance advances proportionately with RPM. Oh, yeah. Where here, you're increasing the RPM, it's still retarded. Yeah, so I can play with that, it's like back it off to 20 degrees until it, yeah. you, know, you start really pushing. But in the mid-range, as you're accelerating, it might, yeah, you're accelerating. It might buck a little bit, but then yeah. once you get up to the top end. That's why I was wondering, do you put, do you put a... Uh, you put it, the mechanical advance off of that in that distributor, and don't I think, I think they're good. and don't use the other. I'm really happy with that. Okay. Um, that was freaking. It did sound good. It was definitely. Yeah. It moved. I mean, on the top end. But again, this thing's a high performance machine. That maybe it was. Maybe it's. It's not designed to drive nice at slow speeds either. Yeah, I mean it's it's made to. A lot of race car stuff was like that. Yeah, I mean you know, this was made to run wide three open. quarter full throttle. That's what doesn't it doesn't matter about you know cruising a street car kind of thing. Yeah, it's made to go flat out. Well, that's pretty cool. Yeah. That's about good for the day. Yeah. I'm happy. Well, thanks for thanks letting for me. Uh, no, thanks for letting me have the opportunity to watch over your shoulder and do, yeah. do this. That was freaking cool. Like I said. If you